Hey everybody, here we are, day 16. Man, Christmas is only nine days away. Are you guys excited? I'm really not, but <laughs> I'm trying to make it look like I am. Anyway, let's get into today's case, and see what we got. Okay guys, here we go. Day 16, way the heck hell over here. And this is gonna be a little bit difficult to get into because I'm stretched across my bar trying to get into this. And this does not, oh there it goes. I'm gonna say this does not wanna open. Let's crack this open, see what we got. Okay, this might not be too bad. This is the Brock Street Double Vision IIPA. That's an Imperial IPA. This is also from their signature series, 7.5% alcohol by volume. Let's get it in the glass and check it out. Okay, so this is our first double IPA or Imperial IPA, if you will, uh, from Brock Street. <coughs> uh, Double Vision IIPA has a strong uh, strong floral and citrus aromatics balanced by a sturdy malt backbone. Medium bitterness and a full body give way to a clean and refreshing finish. Enjoy. Okay, uh, strong floral. Uh, not one of my favorite things in the entire world. But if it's done properly, you know, it can actually really help out your beer. So today I'm going to be using my Alchemist Brewery glass uh, that I picked up when I was down in Vermont uh, this past summer. Um, at the exact same uh, place that uh, Wayne from Wayne's uh, from Bucks County Beer Reviews was at this past. We were both there actually in the exact same, I think it's the same weekend. And neither one of us realized that the other person was there and we didn't get a chance to hook up or hang out. And as I'm sitting here looking at the monitor on the camera, look at the freaking wrinkles on this kid's face. I've been noticing that the past couple of videos. I don't know if you guys noticed it. Man, my wrinkles are getting really, really bad. Anyway, I digress. So let's take a look at this beer here. Oh, nice. I like the color of that. That is a nice, like, medium gold kind of color. A bit of amber in there. It looks great. Let's give it a little nose here. Pick it up by a bit of a citrus. More of a, maybe like an orange kind of, kind of smell to it. Maybe a, maybe a bit of a pineapple in there too. Oh, it smells pretty decent. It's pretty, pretty light on the aroma, but it smells decent. Let's give it a try, guys. Cheers. Oh, okay. Hang on. Let's have a little bit more, shall we? Okay. Quite nice. Quite, uh, quite smooth. Right at the back end, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the, the aftertaste first. Right at the back end, you're getting that that hoppy, drying bitterness way, way at the back. Really, really nice. Get a little bit of a tropical fruit in there. Get those nice little, nice little citrus notes that you would expect in an IPA. Um, I don't. Did I catch any floral in the? I'll just check and see if there's any floral in the aroma. I didn't notice. I didn't notice any. There's just a, barely a hint of floral in the taste, which is fine. Less floral in the in the taste is fine by me. But yeah, a little bit, little bit on the bitter side. Like I said, you're getting that right at the back. You're getting that drying hoppiness, which I like a lot. Of, some people don't though. They don't like that super dryness, and it just makes you want to drink more and more. So uh, let's drink more and more. Yeah, you know what? If you like a hoppy, bitter beer, this is the one that you're gonna to wanna to get, the Double Vision IPA. It is really, really decent. On a scale of one to five, I'm gonna give this a four. I said, I like that. I can still feel it, it's so, it's so dry. Just right, right, way, way, way at the back. It's super, super dry. I actually enjoy that little dryness. It just makes you wanna drink more, and hey, there's nothing wrong with that. So anyway, guys. That is the Brock Street Double Vision Imperial IPA. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow for day 17. Don't forget to check that out. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.